Hi, this is Gilles, the Radio Prepper. You know, a few weeks ago when I experimented with the quarter wave antenna for 20 meters, I had it up a fiberglass mast. And when I took it down, I just let the antenna on the ground in a heap and the radio was still on. And I was receiving just fine. Which reminded me of a few stories about people laying their antenna down on the grass. There is actually a term for that. It's called a grass tenna. <laughs> and using it. So I wondered, does it actually work? Can you just lay your antenna on the grass or on the ground and transmit, receive and have a conversation? So today we're going to try that. I heard that it works in uh, deserts, like desert sand, because of course sand is glass, so it's non-conductive. Laying your antenna on the desert sand is just like putting it up, uh, you know, 20, 30 feet maybe. We don't have desert sand here, but we sure have wet ground, so let's try it out. So my plan is to uh, lay my wire on the ground here and uh, string it uh, down to that uh, area over there where I can have some shade and we'll see if it works. Well, I want to put it there, but people are walking by and uh, I'm afraid someone would uh, just catch the wire with their feet and fall. <laughs> uh, it's not them I'm worried about, it's, it's breaking my wire. Alright, this is better. Gives them room to pass. And I'm going to be all the way down there by the trees. Here's the uh, transformer. The grass is about an, an inch tall. Just about an inch, so... And the wire, of course, is uh, laying on it 134 foot, 40 meters. Well, I'm surprised that I didn't forget anything, but uh, here we have the uh, QCX on 80 meters. Of course, something like this would work much better on the lower bands, f uh, 80 and 40 meters. I have an 8-pack of uh, AA batteries, alkaline. I have a little VHO speaker you can't see here. My Kent key and the uh, Elecraft T1 tuner. Oh, and by the way, I have this new uh, Retevis RT3S uh, dual band DMR radio which I will talk about in another video. Now let's uh, let's tune this antenna. I don't think it would work without a tuner because it's so close to the ground, but uh, I do have my tuner here, so I'm gonna use that. There we go. That was weird. Uh, I think the uh, common mode currents are messing up the uh, key uh, chip. I'm not hearing anything, but uh, it's the middle of the day, so uh, there is not much chance to hear someone on 80 meters right now. But you never know. I'm going to call and uh, we'll see if uh, we get any reports on the uh, reverse beacon network. Well guys, it's not working very well. <laughs> I keep calling here and uh, I'm not getting any answer and I don't see anything on the uh, reverse beacon network. So, oh, I have to be careful. because my friend Ray is gonna think that I have a big beard now. <laughs> but anyway, oh, he, uh, he made a funny graphic. Uh, I'll show it to you here. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, it's not working well, not surprising. The the ground is pretty uh, pretty soggy here. And uh, I think a lot of current is, is flowing back to the radio because I can hear the Kia is not behaving properly. Something is not quite right. Uh, it's I hear a lot of thumping and it's uh, it, it seems to be cutting short the dials and I, I don't know, something to the ear is not right. So I definitely think it's the, uh, the common mode currents that are being reflected. Uh, and are actually not radiated and coming back and uh, messing up my uh, Kia chip. So I definitely wouldn't rely on that for, <laughs> for transmitting. I think that even uh, elevating the antenna by just, you know, maybe 10 feet uh, is enough to make a huge difference. And uh, I, I don't think I'm going to uh, try that again, maybe just, just as a curiosity, but uh, I don't think it's, it's gonna work. Maybe, uh, well, maybe tonight. I don't know if there was more people and uh, the propagation maybe isn't right right now, so maybe I should try again, but uh, 
So far, no cigar. Still no luck. I think it all depends on the ground and uh, if I had a better ground here, maybe it would work. And I think it's possible, definitely. Because I've heard people tell me that, uh, you know, they have tried it and uh, it, it did work for them, especially on sand, once again. So if you've tried it before, you know someone who did, uh, post a comment below. I guess I'm going to call it a day. Maybe I'll try another time. We'll see. Have a good one.